Breaking news in Margate, where a child is now in the hospital after being struck by a car. CBS 4's Carrie Codd just arrived on the scene. Carrie, what can you tell us? Well, we're getting some additional information right now. A 12 year old boy was struck by this car here behind me in the city of Margate. Apparently, the child was walking home from school. He saw a family member who was driving this car, and then a police officer on scene, as well as a witness on scene, told us for some reason the child was fooling around, got on the hood of that car, was on the hood of that car for about 10 to 15 feet. It's unclear if the child hopped off of the car or fell off of the car. At any rate, the child went underneath the vehicle and got pinned. Take a look at these pictures from Chopper 4. You can see what's going on from an aerial view as a tow truck is here to remove this car from the scene. We are told that after the child was pinned under the vehicle, then a group of neighbors just sprang into action. One woman grabbed some towels, gathered up some neighbors. By that time, the police had arrived. We're told that two Margate police officers, as well as several bystanders, got together and actually lifted this vehicle off of that child as a neighbor then grabbed the child and pulled him out from underneath the car. You can take a look now at some video showing that child being airlifted to the hospital. Broward Health Medical Center in Fort Lauderdale. We are told that the boy suffered road rash over a lot of his body, was actually being burned by something underneath the car that was very hot. We are told the child was conscious and alert when he was taken to the hospital. At this point, we do not have word on his exact or precise injuries or his condition at this point. Still under investigation, we're told that the family member of the boy did remain on scene, did speak with investigators. We're told it's too early to say what, if any, citation she might face. And that's the story here in Margate. Carrie Codd, CBS 4 News. Carrie.